Here with head coach Todd Schulenberger. Just a quick breakdown of the game at UW on Friday and, and where the Cougs are headed to Colorado this weekend. Well, definitely an unfortunate way to lose a game at the end there. Um, you know, coming off a couple of weeks off, it took us a while to get going. That's uh, no disrespect to UW. They're a great team this year. Um, we got going in the second half and uh, tied it up. And then, um, again, just a fluky way to lose. It is what it is. Uh, we're a hungry group. We're excited to get back. And uh, we had excellent two days of practice. And we're looking forward to coming back and playing in this wide open Pac-12 conference. How do you shake off a, a loss like that? Not just uh, to your rival, but a, just a, like you said, a tough way to, to to lose that game. I feel like we're a bounce back team as is. We're probably a resilient group. We've been to this before. It's not like any year we've been here that I've been here. We haven't had any game where it's, it's getting into, um, we got to do some work. And uh, you're saying that with only one loss. So um, due to the shortened tournament field and, and what's ahead of us, there's plenty of opportunities ahead of us for there, which is one game at a time. But we're extremely hungry to get back on the road here and uh, take care of something that uh, we felt like we left out there, especially late in the game. What were uh, some of the good things that you pull out of that game and what, what are some of the things you, you feel like the team's still working on? Well, I mean, we got to get better in our rhythm and, our, and, and playing better soccer. Um, you know, I, I was impressed with some of our younger players that stepped in and gave a good moment in that type of game. Um, you know, our midfield play has got to be better here. Uh, you know, there, there's a lot to learn. But there's, again, you can flip side, and I tell the team every day that there's no excuses right now. It is what it is when you, you miss some games. But uh, let's not use that as an excuse for missing rhythm, missing games. Let's use it as uh, we just got to get better. And, uh, again, yesterday and today are any indication we're heading on the right track here and uh, one day at a time. Can you just talk a little bit about uh, Mock's goal, how impressive it might have been from the – on TV it was really impressive because he went about 70 yards. Yeah, that's a mock, Mock's good on the ball, good dribble, good take players on, and uh, – you know, uh, big players step up in big moments. And, you know, I felt like we had a couple of other opportunities definitely left out there. Um, but, you know, you look to her, rely on her, her and other seniors to do what they need to do. And uh, Mock's a very talented player. She's a player that's watched for sure, but very talented at the same time. Uh, you go to Colorado, another road game, the next three, because the LA is after that. What, uh, what can teams or what can people expect out of the game on uh, Saturday in Boulder against the Colorado well, squad? Yeah, I mean, th their style is, uh, you know, they, they're, they're doing a good job. Defensively, they do a heck of a job. They're scoring a lot of ball, a lot of goals on dead ball restarts. And uh, that's what they do. And they got a plan and a purpose and credit to them. I'm not worried about the weather. I'm not worried about any of that. We live with that here every day in Pullman. So that's, that's water on the bridge for us. Cold, wet, snowy, rainy. That's what we do here every day. So it's just going to come down to us executing our game plan and they're going to have a plan for them. And, Who's going to prevail will, will to be determined. And then uh, lastly, just how's the health of the team? I know there were some injuries and, and then you, COVID and how's everything going? Yeah, we're just about back. Um, you know, we go, you know, of course, Bree's out for the year here. But, uh, yeah, I mean, again, it's a funny game. And injuries are one thing, COVID's something else. And uh, But the Cougs are coming back and we're getting players back. And it's fun to have a lot of people in practice. We haven't had that for weeks. So uh, it's a good thing. Uh, we're excited. We're positive. And like I said, with this team, we choose positive here. And, we're ready to bounce back against a very good Colorado team. And lastly, what do you what do you need to do to, to win the game on Saturday? What 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 do you think is the the keys to that match? We just can't commit silly fouls. We can't give up silly free kicks. You know, we play our game. We're in, we're in a good position. But uh, you know, it's going to be back and forth game. Every game's tight. Uh, we got to solve their defensive scheme. They've got to solve ours. Um, we got to be good in front of goal. We got to be good defensively. And you know, we can't give up any silly goals. I mean, that's just bottom line there. And uh, finish our chances when they're in front of us.